Before we begin, click subscribe to stay up to date with all of our newest video content. This is Christy Womack. The knowledge tip from CS3 Today is using a side panel on a generic inquiry within Acumatica. Today I'm going to show you how to save clicks and stop you from traveling down rabbit holes. Most everyone is familiar with viewing a generic inquiry. Just about any screen you go into you start out with as a generic inquiry. Once there, you can either click on the blue hyperlink to open said document or double click on the line. If you are on a purchase order GI, it will take you to the specific purchase order you clicked on. However, if you're on a vendor GI, double clicking or clicking the blue hyperlink will take you to the specific vendor. If you were on a purchase order GI and wanted to see the vendor for your selected purchase order, you would have to open a new window and follow the tree to locate the vendor via a search or you would open the PO, then open the vendor by clicking on the pencil from there. While it is doable either way, what if you could have the best of both worlds without that much clicking around? In the new Acumatica 2019 R1, we're able to do just that. In this example, I am going to show you how to create a sidebar on a purchase order generic inquiry so you can view the vendor detail or purchase order detail at the same time you're looking at the generic inquiry itself. Open the generic inquiry you are wishing to modify. On the navigation tab, click the plus under screens. Click the magnifying glass to bring up the tree to navigate to the desired screen. In my example, we are going to choose the vendor screen On window mode, the drop down options are same tab, which means the screen will open in the same browser tab instead of the inquiry, which is the default mode. New tab, which means the screen opens in a new browser tab, or pop up window, which means the screen opens in a new pop up. Select side panel. I am leaving the icon field blank at this time and it will default as a folder. Click the plus on the right side of the page under navigation parameters. Select account CD under the field and vendor.accountcd under parameter. We will now add the purchase order to the side panel. Click on the plus under the screens and navigate to the purchase order screen. Select side panel, click the plus under navigation parameters and match up the order number with the PO order number and the order type with the PO order type. Click save. Click view inquiry and you will notice there is a couple of new icons to the right side of the page. Let's explore what we just created. Click on the arrow to open the side panel. The first tab will open and it shows the vendor screen we added. If we click on the next icon, it will open the purchase order screen. Say you wanted to see if there were any addresses overridden on any of your POs. Instead of having to go into each PO and clicking on the vendor info tab, you can bring up the side panel and arrow up and down through the list and see if anything changes. Thank you for allowing me to show you something new and exciting. Was this video helpful? Click subscribe to see more videos like this one.